Hope can mean different things for different people. For Cindy, hope is best defined by four words. My daughter had a party, and she told me to stay upstairs in the bedroom because she knew I was drinking. She was really ashamed of me. I mean, she got really upset, took me back upstairs, threw me on the, on the bed, had her hands wrapped around my throat and said, I wish you were dead. That was horrible. That was the turning point. That's when I decided to do something. And I've always had my Bible with me, but I didn't know how to read. So it was hard. <sighs> For Cindy, the second word that would define hope is literacy. When I came to Portland Rescue Mission, um, my uh, phase leader knew that I didn't know how to read because we talked about that, and my advocate knew, and they made arrangements for me to have a tutoring on Wednesdays and Thursday, and her name was Sue. I've been a public school teacher for 36 years, and I had uh, reading assessments with me, which would identify her reading level, and I gave her homework each week each Wednesday and um, she always brought it back, you know, always came to the session, you know, expecting to, expecting to uh, learn and when people expect to do well, they do well. I've definitely seen a change in her. I've um, seen the incremental changes and uh, so she's a lot more confident in her abilities than probably what she realizes. As I'm learning how to read, I'm learning God's Word. And it's an awesome feeling to learn how to read. And this is the Living Bible. It says, For the angel of the Lord guards all who fears Him, and He rescues them. And I feel like He rescued me. But I was really fearful. It's really hard. Give more than a meal, more than a bed. Give hope. <sighs> My life is back. I'm not in that dark shadow anymore. I'm in the light, in God's light. You believe that alcohol is all you have because you have nothing else. But that's not true. I learned in a, in a short period of time that you can change it. You got choices. And I could have not done it without the ladies and the tools that they gave me. God's love and God's grace. And here I am today saying everything is possible with God. It's exhilarating to know how to read. It's, it's, uh, I feel smart. <laughs> I feel smart. <laughs> Your support provides education, emotional healing, and total life recovery to hurting women like Cindy. Click the Donate Now button or call 503-MISSION. <laughs>